Hey, it's still New York Comic Con reveals time, so we have another video for all of our fans at MaddieCollector.com. I'm Scott Knightlick, also known as Toy Guru on the forums, and I'm here to talk about today the Motu Minis. So here I have the entire 2014 Minis line before me. We've had a new pack every other month throughout 2014, and we're wrapping them at the, ep at the end of the year. We have uh, King, He-Man, and Clawful coming out. That'll help you wrap up and finish your 2014 line. And when you get all of the 2014 Minis 2 packs, you are going to be able to construct this awesome Castle Grayskull mini diorama, complete with working jaw bridge. So, you know, He-Man can be right there and, you know, do his I have the power. And you can even, you know, put some of the bad guys up there on top. And, oh, there goes Scare Glow falling down. But you get the point. So uh, lots of places to display your figures, lots of different uh, ways to interact with your minis and a new way to collect He-Man and the Masters of the Universe at mini scale. But wait, we're not done. We have a 2015 line we'd like to produce, but much like the six inch line, we can't do that without your help. So we're gonna run the 2015 minis line as a subscription, as we announced back in San Diego Comic-Con. The subscription is gonna go on sale very soon and it's going to include six different minis two packs throughout 2015, shipping approximately every other month. And in addition to that, while in 2014, you're able to build your Castle Grayskull up by getting it a piece at a time over the six packs, the difference for 15 is the new diorama, Snake Mountain. Let's go to a shot of that real quick. So there you see Snake Mountain looking really awesome. Two different places to display your figures, all the details with the lava. All right, so that is our Snake Mountain pack. So back here with the toys, that Snake Mountain is gonna come as one, uh, well, I think it'll be disassembled, you'll have to assemble it, but you'll get all six pieces in one box. That's gonna be your sub-only item. Kind of similar how Ular is the sub-only six-inch figure. For the minis, the incentive to get all six of the two packs is you will get Snake Mountain as one set. It'll come in a little uh, box altogether. So it won't be pieces in each figure set. So that's the incentive to sub, but who are you going to get? Well, we've already revealed our first figure, so uh, here we have, kind of close to production, right there doing her Honor of Grayskull. There is our first female line, She-Ra! Do-do-do-do-do. Actually, that's the He-Man line song. Uh, She-Ra here, so our first female. So uh, she has her Sword of Protection, just like that with the jewel, as well as her shield, which clips into her hand, come on, there we go. Just like that, just like they've all got that little uh, L hook there to go right into the hands. She-Ra, of course, she's articulated at the head, at the hands, at the waist. So our first female in the line, the heroic princess of power, Adam's twin sister, Adora. And she will come with a Horde Trooper minifigure. One of the coolest minis I think we've done. He is awesome. So articulated all, again, at the shoulders, at the waist and the head moves as well. He will come with two accessories. He will have his Vibe Shock Rod, just like in the series, as well as the Horde Shield that the Horseman actually created for the six inch line. And so that's a mini version of that. So it just slides in again with that, that L hook that all the accessories tend to work versus clipping on the wrist like some of the six inch figures. So there's the Horde Trooper. Now of course you can buy multiple packs and start army building your horde troopers, but it'll just be one horde trooper paired with She-Ra, so that's what you'll get in the pack. It will not come with a piece of Snake Mountain, because Snake Mountain, as I mentioned earlier, will be coming as a full diorama as your sub-only item. Now, we can only move forward with the 2015 sub if we hit our minimum. Obviously, we really want to make more of these, but it's one of those things that just like with the six inch, we can't do it without your help. So now is the time. Help spread the word. Let people know about the minis. We also reveal the second pack. Let's go to an image of that. So here you can see the second pack is going to be Mecha Neck with that awesome removable neck piece, as well as Jitsu with his swords. So those are gonna be the second pack, uh, shipping in the first part of quarter two or the end of quarter one. We have also to reveal at New York Comic Con's kind of digital experience. Now this isn't gonna be the third pack, but it will be one later in the year. So here's a still image of one of the upcoming pack to entice you to get the sub. Trapjaw and Ram Man. Look at how cool they look as minis. 
Trapjaw's got his great gun arm, Ram Man's got his axe, it looks really, really awesome in mini form. Now this is not pack number three. This one is later in the year, but we really wanted to show this one just because, honestly, as you can see, the horseman knocked it out of the park. So those are going to be three of the two packs that you're going to be getting. There'll be three more, obviously, to be revealed, including pack number three, which we actually haven't revealed yet. The Ram Man Trap Jaw pack is going to come later in the year if we can get the minimum, which we think we can do because these are really darn popular. We're really excited about them, but we can't do it without you guys' support. So help spread the word. Let's make the mini sub happen. You'll get your She-Ra, you'll get your Horde Trooper, lots more exciting mini characters, as well as that awesome Snake Mountain diorama. We'll see you right back here on MaddieCollector.com for some of the latest news and reveals. We'll keep it small for the minis, and uh, we'll see you on the forums.